over the last two two months we've uh, taken part in a pre-season which has brought us all close together with team bonding activities um, and just the general toughness of, of the pre-season um, scheme um, all the, with all the new signings coming in uh, we've all, all gotten really really well um, yeah and we're just I've I've gotten really well with all the boys and we're, we're just ready to get into the season now we've got one more friendly against London at the weekend and then we're in you received dozens of offers from different clubs before the decision to join Dewsbury Rams. Um, what made the decision to join Dewsbury, like you find the decision, what made him stand out? Uh, the coach was a massive influence for me. Um, people have only had good things to say about him. He's had Super League experience, which he could potentially pass on to me. Um, he's learnt off, off good coaches, um, good people around him, so he, as we say, he can only pass it down. Further on, um, the Dewsbury Rams finished uh, fairly mid-table last year, so they're very competitive within the within the championship. So uh, we'd like to be competing again for that championship shield and and potentially the top four. And we spoke before about your ambitions to return to the Super League. Do you think they're realistic in terms of like what you see in the next five years? Uh, with being being uh, the fullback for. For Dewsbury, I don't see why not. Um, I'm in the I'm in the shop window for for the Super League um, clubs. Um, it's just up to me to to prove myself to the clubs um, and sort of stay consistent on the field, um, making sure my communication is right um, within the team, and just sort of generally helping the team um, on a week to week basis, trying to push for those. And just a final question: You've um, you've sold out to like a part-time rugby rugby league job now, and you've now started like your own um, pretty subtle company, PDN. Uh, do you see PDN as like your future after your life in rugby? Potentially, really strong interest in the uh, in the fitness industry, so um, strength and conditioning, um, and supplements are just a small part of that. Uh, I could potentially go with it full time if it kicks off, but if it doesn't, um, then I can go down other avenues within the fitness industry.